For those of you who are taking thesis seminar, I wanted to share with you the error code list that can be found in Notion. So if you open up the file that's uh, that uh, can be found in the Notion page, you'll see a list of the codes. So when I go in to leave feedback, especially at the paragraph and sentence level, I probably will be using codes from this list. So if you're not familiar with these codes, have this list available, have it handy so that you can refer to it as you need to. Some errors are more serious than others. I would say probably the most serious are those that include the sentence fragment and the run-on sentence. Those are probably the uh, the most serious. Not, not, not necessarily the most common, but the, the most serious. If you have those types of errors, uh, that uh, those need to be really researched and uh, you need to clarify, first of all, when this error is occurring and how to fix it. The rest of the errors are less serious, but probably the most common is the common uh, the comma splice. Okay, so try to avoid the comma splice in academic writing. In formal writing, we want to avoid the comma splice. Other common errors include wrong word and, and uh, word choice. These are very similar, but they're different. Word choice means perhaps the word that you're using uh, is awkward, but maybe the message still can be understood. So it's less serious, but maybe we find a different word for uh, to substitute the, uh, the word that you're using. In contrast, wrong word means that it actually is interfering with the message. Okay, so these are a little bit more serious. It still has to deal with the word that you're using, but uh, in this case, the wrong word means that it's actually interfering uh, with the message. So take a look at the rest of these. I'm not going to go through all of them, but uh, do take a look at this. Remember pronouns. Sometimes I'll use uh, the code PRO for pronoun when either the pronoun is being overused or maybe the antecedent to that pronoun is not clear. Gender-specific language, GS, APA. Okay, so we've got some other uh, errors here. Again, some are used more than others. Uh, the wrong prep preposition, that, that pops up. Word form, WF. Word form means that you can use the same word, but use a different variation, right? So instead of maybe the, the noun form, you use the verb form. Maybe instead of the adjective form, you use the adverbial form, et cetera. Okay, so word form refers to uh, the actual part of speech. Again, try to use the same word, or I, I will be encouraging you to use the same word, but a different, uh, a different part of speech. All right, so I hope this helps. Have this handy. If you have any questions about any of these codes, of course, if you have any questions about any of the feedback, reply to my comments in Microsoft Word. Again, many times I'll just include the code. Other times I may include the code with some explanation. But either way, if you do have any questions, of course, make sure you're uh, asking. Okay, so we'll see you guys. Remember, our due date is for next week, March 5th, to complete our literature review.